Hey everyone, it's Jessie from JessieLovesBeauty.com. Today I've teamed up with Aveda Institute esthetician Samantha Town to bring you her professional tips on how to do a facial at home. So keep watching and I'll show you how to get flawless skin in your bedroom. As you can see, I'm in my dorm room myself, so let's get started. For any facial, it's important to start with clean skin. I'm doing this after a day of class, so I currently have makeup on. So I'm using a cloth makeup remover wipe, and I'm just going to use this to get the makeup and dirt from the day off of my face. I'm going to start by using a damp washcloth to wet down my face. I'm just gently patting it all over my face to get my skin nice and damp for the cleanser. I'm then going to take my favorite cleanser by Alba Botanica and using about a quarter sized amount I'm going to use circular motions to apply this to all areas of my face. I'm going to use the same damp washcloth to remove the cleanser from my face and then pat my face dry with my favorite Norwex washcloth. Next I'm going to use my favorite exfoliating face scrub with salicylic acid from St. Ives. I'm going to use a quarter size amount of this and apply it to damp skin. Town recommends an exfoliating mask with salicylic because this will help to draw dirt from the pores as well as fight acne. Because most people don't have a steamer at home, Town recommends jumping in a warm shower to open up the pores to let the mask really sink into the skin. After rinsing off the exfoliating mask in the shower, Town recommends using a treatment mask that is suited for your skin tone. I will be using a Derma E cleansing enzyme mask with dead sea salt that is supposed to deep cleanse and has a detoxifying formula. After letting your treatment mask sit for 10 minutes, wash it off and then you are ready to apply a toner. According to town, it's very important to use a toner because it'll prep the skin for the moisturizer and it allows for greater penetration of the products. Lastly, apply a moisturizer. I'm using my favorite moisturizer from Cetaphil. I love this moisturizer in particular because it's non condomingenic so it won't clog my pores and it's for dry, sensitive skin. You are going to apply the moisturizer all over your face as well as your neck and your decollete. And voila! An easy to do and inexpensive way to get a facial at home. Do this weekly and not only will you love the condition your skin is in, but your skin will love you for it. Thanks for watching and stay tuned for more how-to videos.